Welcome and welcome back to Scorpio Tiger's Tarot. I'm Scorpio Tiger. I'm here to do the weekly reading for the sign of Taurus. I hope everyone is doing well. Let's get into this. I've already shuffled the deck. Okay. Thank you for being patient with me. Okay. What's the overall energy for the Taurus collective, the world? Good stuff. Something's coming to an end. Okay. Or a new beginning. Success. Okay. Let's get some energies for the Taurus collective. What's going on with the Taurus collective this week of June? The 5th, 2022, or whenever they are guided to watch this video. Okay, that was weird. I'm going to take it. We got the Ace of Cups, the Five of Pentacles. We have the Ten of Cups. Make sure you guys can see that. The Ten of Swords, something's definitely coming to an end. And a new beginning, the Ace of Swords and the Three of Cups. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Father. And a Wheel of Fortune is all orchestrated. I, I can't make it up. Y'all see how them cards all came out like that? I almost, you know, I always put them back, but I said I'm going to stop doing that. We're going to take the cards and see what, what the messages are. Okay. All right. That is the original Rider weight. This is the Modern Witch Tarot deck here. Okay. All right. Let's see what's going on. The Ace of Cups. Why is this here for the Taurus Collective? I got to see which one. Okay. The sun in reverse. Okay. So the Ace of Cups talks about um, whatever you desire is overflowing, really. Um, but it, it mainly speaks of love. Um, but for some reason, you're feeling like you're burdened by this. Let's get one more card. Why is this Ace of Cups here? For the Taurus Collective. Oh my yeah because love's not working you love this person whoever you are with this is weird i've never seen this before um yeah because the sun talks about uh feeling um stuck i'm gonna double check that hold on a second i just want to double check it Yeah, feeling trapped, but you will feel better soon because you, 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 but you'll feel better soon. You feel stuck, but it says that you'll feel better soon um, because you'll realize that this love just isn't working because that's what the Ace of Cups talks about. It talks about unrequited love. It's just, it's just not working. Okay. So you're not, you're going to be unstuck in a while. I mean, you know, in a little bit, I guess. Yeah, um, all right, Doris. Now we got, but somebody's holding on to this whole ordeal with the four pentacles. Make sure my card's okay. Four pentacles. Why is this here for the Taurus Collective? Why is the four of pentacles? Thank you. Because they're unstable. The Emperor in reverse, if you're new to my channel, I am new to, uh, I mean, I'm still learning my reversal. Sorry about that. Um, but the the emperor in reverse, I'm sure, is talking about, um, yeah, abuse of power. Somebody is really excessively controlling. Yeah, somebody is excessively controlling. They're they are holding on to this, and you feel so trapped in this. The love is there, but you, you guys just aren't working. But they are holding on. You or them, because I, I can tell this is a love reading. So just take what resonates, and I mean, uh, take what resonates, leave the rest, and reverse the roles as needed, okay? Why is this Ten of Cups here? They're going to be free. Taurus going to be free. <laughs> Why is this Ten of Cups here for the Taurus Collective? Okay. The world in reverse. I got to look that up. And, um... What are these? Somebody's putting in the work and feeling really stressed right now. But let me see what the world in reverse is. It's universe or time. Okay. But it's in reverse. 
So it's a lack of uh, success, stagnation, um, lack of achievement. Okay, so somebody's feeling bad because this relationship didn't work out. Okay, and they've put so much work in with the Eight of Pentacles. And it's really, it's really bothering them. It's stressing them out. They just don't know what to do. Because they wanted this contentment of the Ten of Cups. Right? Okay. The Ten of Swords. Let me make sure my cards are right. Ten of Swords. Why is this here for the Taurus Collective? The Ten of Swords. Okay. This is definitely over. Um, there's nothing that can be even salvaged. It's been very painful, but it's over now, okay? Yeah, you don't get that too often, too. The Ten of Swords, clarifying the Ten of Swords. Ace of Swords, you're going to get all the clarity that you need, Taurus. Why is the Ace of Swords here? You're going to get your clarity about this whole situation um, through communication. Ace of Swords, why is this here? It's painful, but now it's over, and you can move forward, okay? You're going to get your clarity. You're going to get your clarity, and you're going to be able to move forward, okay? With that chariot there, you're going to be able to move forward, even move out of your out of the house, out of the state, whatever. But some clarity is going to come in about this whole situation, why it's not working, you know, and, and why it had to end, okay? Yeah somebody's holding on okay the three of cups why is this here are you gonna move away to happier times yeah you're gonna put the burdens down with the ten of wands and move to a happier a happier place at least you're being told to okay move put them burden burdens down and move into a more joyful energy okay what's at the bottom of this right somebody's watching you from the past with the six of pentacles you're just trying to stay focused on, and, and you're in prayer. You're working on yourself is what I'm seeing. And you're praying about this contentment, this happy family life, okay? And you're putting the work in. You're being admired. You're being admired for sticking in this for as long as you have. Yes. But it's like it was a karmic love affair that you've been bound to. You're being told to focus on your money or a message is going to come in that's going to bring you some, some justice, okay? The king of swords, crossing your T's and dotting your I's. This could be an a air sign, but I, this is a Gemini card. Uh, the king of swords, Gemini, Aquarius, Libra, okay? Now you, may, you may get some justice from this individual here because you found out some truths with the high priestess. So you're going to cut this stuff off. Even though you regret that it did not work out with that Ten of Cups right here. You regret that this didn't work. You have a lot of regrets about this relationship, about how it did not work. Um, but it's time for you to make a decision um, for your overall happiness, your contentment. So I'm getting this, this feeling like somebody was uh, just not compatible with you or you, them. Reverse the roles is needed. And it's just not working. And it looks like you tried to make it work with the with the Eight of Pentacles. Someone really tried to make it work, and it, it really is just stressing them out. And they, you're gonna put it into it, but you're gonna have to, you're gonna make a choice to uh, go after um, a new love with the Two of Cups. You need someone that's mutual that that mutually respects you, that loves you mutually. You have um, some sort of like minds, same beliefs. Okay, yeah. And, and, and you're praying about it. You're praying about this new path, okay? Because you don't want this heartache anymore. You don't want to feel this 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 grief and uh, this pain of loss. You don't want to feel it anymore, okay? So you want to be single for a while, and and, and you want a new beginning. You know, you know, you want some sleep because you're not getting any sleep with this nine of swords. You know, it's stressing you out. You got so much anxiety with the, with the three of wands also, you know, but it's here with these two ten of swords is letting you know it's going to be over. So just make a plan. Reflect on where you've been. Um, you, you may even want to reflect on the relationship. Why has why it couldn't work? 
um, really think logically, you know, about, about what was going on and make your plan as to what you want in the future. Think about what it is that you want. Concentrate on that so that it'll come to you. Use your creative mind. What makes you happy, Taurus, okay? Uh, yeah, because you're going to walk away and everything is going to be fine, okay? All right. Um, This is a breakup. Really don't know what to get you on this one. Um, let's just go. Let's let's just grab you some kipper. Okay, something telling me the romance angels. Okay, because this is all about love. So, uh oh. -uh. All right, Taurus. What's going on with the Taurus collective? Okay, any advice for the Taurus Collective regarding the spread? Thank you. It's telling you to flirt. Extend your lighthearted energy to others. Playfulness. To recapture, to recapture romance, allow your inner youthful spirit of, of fun to shine. Okay. Wow. Okay. I'll take it. Okay. It says very soon. Oh, sorry. Let me read that to you. A uh, clarity to uh, clearly decide what you want so that it comes to you. That's what I just told you. Clearly decide what it is that you want in a relationship. Chemistry. There's a strong magnetic attraction here. Okay. You know your life. Trust. This situation is calling for you to have faith. Okay? And let go of control issues. This this right here, somebody's controlling right here. Definitely. Allow the situation to unfold naturally. Love these cards. Express your love. Go ahead and make the romantic gesture. You know your life, okay? Um, reconciliation. Someone from your past is returning to your life. Okay. I think I've seen another card. Yes. All right, um, Taurus, that is your reading. Thank you so much for for hanging in there with me. And like I said, I've been busy. I got to I got to pay the bills, okay. But I'm going to still be getting readings out. Thanks for holding, for hanging in there, and for those of you who enjoyed this reading, make sure you like, share, and subscribe. And you guys take care. I'll talk to you soon. Bye bye.